Hey there, friends. Got a TT. Wait, this is a two-parter? Operation Dude Rescue? Whoa, everyone's looking fancy. As fancy as me. Oh, is it for them? <laughs> Not moist. A moist spot. overhydrated myself, me ladies. Not my ladies. They're missing for doors and everything. What is going on here? Also, I gotta say, I was not expecting a two-parter, but this is part one. I can't wait to see how crazy the plot is gonna be if it's like the last two-parter. The special episode we had. Also, I thought Raven would like this. I thought she would like seeing Beast Boy all cleaned up. You know what I mean? He peed himself what? hand upon the floor. <laughs> Indubitably. Ew. He peed himself. Ew. Gross. <laughs> Please, allow me. Why is there a door the behind the door? Before? We just had it installed so we would have something to open for you. Oh my uh, goodness. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry, but Raven just yelling ill while Beast Boy was laying his jacket on the floor. <laughs> oh my goodness. This episode is already off to a great start, especially Cyborg saying he peed himself. <laughs> What is going on here? <laughs> how many doors were there gonna be? I'm just curious how many more Ooh. You must be cold. What? I'm fine. <laughs> Nonsense. Here. Take my coat. But you are not the cold. Are you cold, Mama? Here's take my coat. Ew. <laughs> I don't want that coat. Get that coat away from them. That's the coat that has the papede on it, you know? We don't want your coats. <laughs> yeah, take my other coat. Take spare coat. Get away from us. Take my flannel. Ooh, a flannel is really nice. <laughs> They're just naming all the jokes. <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> How? The whole coat hanger? Yeah. Ew. They just ran over the papede. But also, what is going on though? Why are these three being so gentlemanly? Like forcefully gentlemanly. I mean, it's nice, but it's forced. Why are you acting like this? Perhaps they are infected with the worms that eat the brains. Oh, Possibly parasites. Great strangeness. Is that it? Is that brain worms giving you strange behaviors? There are no brain worms in us, m'lady. Stop saying m'lady. Oh, I have worms in me, but uh, not in my brains. This oh. Is strange. Oh. They're doing this because they're the man and they have to be nice to the woman. But also, Beast Boy, you need to get that checked out. If you don't have worms in your head, you got bum worms. Get those bum worms checked out, boy. Is where dudes be gentlemen and do things for ladies. <laughs> I mean, yeah, but you're kind of for. Dead. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Terrible news. My condolences. Here, take another coat. <laughs> Not with the coat. You will never die because being a gentleman never goes out of style. Yeah, checks me out. I'm such a gentleman. Yeah. Oh, where the cure came from? Oh, the wink the You feel me, little buddy? Of course you don't. I'm chill. Okay, that is really gentle though, but I don't I I where'd the cat come from? I So I want to know why the chivalry though. Are they gonna be chivalrous throughout this two part episode? I do wonder what the Operation Dude Rescue means though, but I hope we'll find that out soon. But I, I like this though. Also, Chivalry isn't dead. Chivalry 2 is out on game stores. Go get Chivalry 2. It's still alive. You call that gentle? I'm the Ooh. gentlest man. My entire Ooh, body is a kitty. Kiss. Oh, wh why are you rubbing that kitty on you? Wow. 
I may be a tuna, and cats love me, but I feel really sorry for that kitty right there. They are... Ugh. Ew, this whole chivalry thing is creeping me out. I agree. Crime alert. Step for kitty. And he's up to something big. Oh, Brian's back. Bring the pain to the brain. Oh, nice oh, rhyme. Please allow us. You're please kidding me. Us. Not the code. <laughs> if we didn't handle this ourselves. Are you joking? Uh, you treat us like equals. Yeah. Oh, sounds like someone's cold again. Here, take this coat. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Now that you're nice and warm, please, my ladies, <laughs> allow us to handle this. Not gonna lie, Raven looks really cute in that crew, all zipped up and whatnot. That looks really comfy. But, you're joking me. To the point that they are just letting the ladies sit this out while the men take care of everything. Chivalry is going way too far. Not even treating their women's, their, their women, their, their women friends as equals, like Raven said. Gentlemen, go. Gentlemen, go. Oh. Oh, are you? That's it? That's it? Where are the tough ones? Wow! We handled this for them that, because we that are didn't, the gentlest That around. took like five seconds. So much what the heck? It seems unwise to face me without them. <laughs> wow! <laughs> chivalry. <laughs> chivalry. <laughs> Question. Question. Remember the episode where everybody was trapped in the brain's lair and all the buddies had to go rescue them? Is Operation Dude Rescue gonna be where Starfire and Raven have to save the dudes? Oh boy, it's a ladies episode, isn't it? Oh my goodness, if they get... <gasps> Is this gonna be another Girls' Night episode? Oh, I hope this is another girl's night out. Ooh, that pelican is chivalrous. Oh, wait. Hold on, they were both playing 3DS. What game do you think they were playing? I'll give you- I'll, I'll have three guesses. They were either playing Animal Crossing New Leaf for the Nintendo 3DS, they were either playing Mario Kart 7 for the Nintendo 3DS, or they were playing Pokemon Omega Ruby Alpha Sapphire for the Nintendo 3DS, or any other game. Ooh. <laughs> we yet. We got a little sidetracked. Just we tell the truth. Thank you, Beast Boy. You sure? You sure? Ray, uh, Does the chivalry yeah. entail the boys being easily apprehended and then saved by the ladies? <laughs> Looks like it. All right. But don't worry, I've got a plan. Oh. To rescue the boys, we'll have to disable the security system. Yeah. I like take out the massive army of robot guards. by shooting all of them. I, I, I like this plan already. By the way, remember the last time that Robin tried to escape because he believed that no one was going to save them and it took him forever while the others were getting rescued by the buddies? Yeah, don't think they're going to get out that quickly. With the guards out of the way, the only thing standing between us and the dudes is a giant metal door that we'll have to break through. <laughs> I like this plan. They felt bad. They started feeling the bad. Charm, but we are only two. We need the team. <gasps> I've got a few people in mind. Oh, on. hold on. This is going to be good. So how are we getting out of here, yo? If only there were more gentlemen around to help. How many more? This gentleman has the perfect plan. Oh, I'm curious how the ladies are going to handle their plan and how the gentlemen are going to deal with their plan. I hope this two-parter turns out to be wacky and insane. Please let it be that. You snuck in a lock pick? <laughs> You're going to remote hack the security systems? <laughs> Those are good ideas right there. We are going to do what? Nothing. What do you mean? Nothing. Exactly. We sit here until we get old. What? Uh, uh, That's not really an escape plan. Yeah? That is where you're wrong. Nobody likes old prisoners. They're depressing and gross. <laughs> Once we're old, the brain will let us go. That's when we find a time machine. So Come back here and rescue our young selves. Oh my goodness. That? Hey. But wait, if they get old, they... I... Wait, what? So, they, they, I love how they, I love how Robin said, oh, we'll get back here by, you know, we'll get back here later. 
they're going to wait here until they're old, and then when Beast Boy becomes Yoda, they're going to save themselves by going back into a time machine. That plan is so good! Okay, okay I so... Say, I am super impressed. They would have to wait, like, what, 50 years? Are you really... Okay! Ladies, please tell me you got a better plan, please! Oh, it's gonna be a girls' night out episode. Please. Oh, do I have a nose? Can I drink a milkshake and then squirt it out my nose? That's a scientific thing that we need to figure out. Can tunas drink milkshakes and laugh so hard that it comes out their nose? We'll have to find out. It's just a theory. Yeah, we're thinking of something even crazier. And we Ooh. Can't do it without you. Are you in? What about the milkshakes? There has got to be milkshakes. We'll after. I'm in. <laughs> All right. I love how they can easily break her out. I have the one question. Why do you have a bucket? Yeah, isn't that the bathroom? The Oh, yo, she's back. Also, what is that graffiti of the TMNT right behind her? But also, that bucket joke could have been either bad or good. I'm glad it's good because that could have been nasty. Hello, Rose. Raven. Rose Wilson is back. Oh, calling us losers. <laughs> Amazing. Like that in years. Look, it wasn't my best put down. Oh, I can't believe how much I missed you. Oh, I'm glad they're still good buddies. You know. You gotta help them for the milkshakes. Now let us do the group hug. Okay, that is really sweet. Even though that Rose and Raven did fight before in Rose's episode, that they're still good buddies, though. I love that we're actually getting, like, a girl's episode featuring these ladies right here. All right. Wait, Terra 2? They're getting everybody. Oh, dang. This is going to be good. What stinks? Oh, I don't know. Maybe it's all the garbage <laughs> you throw in here. <laughs> oh. Easy. Nice. Your help. After you imprisoned me here, there's no way I'd help you. <laughs> you out of the trash hole. Oh. That's interested. Wait, really? Joy, living in the world of the garbage forever. Yeah, literally. That you you got your way out. You get to help the girls and you get to stay out the trash hole. But I was not expecting them to go for Terra, though. They are literally getting their own Teen Titans crew. That... This is awesome. I, I'm really enjoying this so far. Wait. <laughs> you can call my bluff. I'll help you. Nice. Have my revenge. <laughs> I mean, of course, though. What? <laughs> you were speaking out loud. But you were doing the evil hand rubbing. <laughs> they were just uh, a little cold. <laughs> now, let's go. Oh, why is Terra in the trash? <laughs> but look at that. Look at this. This is this is going to be an awesome episode. While the gentlemen are not doing anything, the ladies are out going to be causing some chaos to free them. Yeah. How long has it been? <laughs> oh. Wait. Sorry, we're late. They actually we're waited? For party breaks. What? what? He said we were late on account of my weak What? what? Robin's oh, plan actually worked? Get us out of here. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold your horses, Sonny. <laughs> yeah? Not, not a GP yet. Two. Did that... Did that really just say 15 feet in two days because old guys walk slow? I gotta say, after like, what, 50 years they've waited for, they waited at, until they were old. I'm pretty sure GPS technology has been, you know, improved so much that it works indoors. 
Does GPS even work indoors? Like, oh yeah, walk up five flights of stairs to go to Hootie Who's office, you know? But they got it working to go to that release switch. We'll just walk on over there and yeah. Push that it's a, How well is this gonna work? <laughs> I get it, they're old. <laughs> oh. I mean, true though, true. So, alarm or. Oh. Doesn't your mask count as glasses? Oh. Oh, wait. Does he think it's an elevator? He really just said, I hope it doesn't go down, but. Cyborg and Beast Boy, Beast Yoda. Like, I keep saying he looks like Yoda. He looks like Yoda. Come on, he is Yoda. That's just Yoda. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Great job. Now they're locked in together. What the? <laughs> oh, I'm really cute. What? What do you guys think? No, really? That's how they're gonna end the episode? We'll pause here and build up the suspense. What? Are you kidding me? They're like, oh yeah, let's do that. How about we just fool everybody and then let them watch the second part? Oh my goodness, what? What an episode though. It's just the chivalry thing that got really funny though, but then I hope that we do have like an action-packed part two though, where the guys do get rescued. But it's crazy to know that Robin's plan almost worked. They did wait. The old men got the time machine and went backwards. So the old men are from the bad future where they never got rescued and waited all those years. But then they got captured. So I wonder what's the next plan for them. Like, this is ridiculous. So let's move on with part two, shall we? Hey, the the, yeah, I was going to say that... Thanks for it. Thanks for coming to my TTG reaction. <laughs> so oh, that didn't make any sense. Yeah. But that is what was previously on. So they did a recap and then they were questioning the recap, even though it was just a bunch of really random moments right there. Okay, but I like it though. Uh, should we have I like that the it. Guys were captured by the brain and we put together a group of cool girls to rescue them. Yeah, that's a way better recap. No, the most exciting of Wait, we're not getting that? What? Thanks, Starfire. Remember the plan. All right, part the 2. Here we go. Rescue the guys and get out. Uh, Will it really be that easy? We went over this like 2 seconds ago. <laughs> Do you think we're dummies? <laughs> I guess I did just say it 2 seconds ago. It felt longer. It's not for it's not for the girls. It's for us to remember. Just in case that in between part one and part two, you literally forgot every single thing that's happened. I'm pretty sure Raven is saying that because the recap wasn't even good. So it's like, by the way, the viewers, they got the girls together and they're going to rescue the guys. Did you get that? I'll repeat it slower. All right, let's do it. I can't wait to see everybody use their skills to rescue the guys. Really knocking? Oh, really? Is that is really that easy? I mean, with Raven, yeah, I'm sure. Ooh. Oh, look how happy Jinx is. <laughs> Oh my goodness, this is great though. I love that these girls have gotten to know each other so well that they're hanging out with each other, except for Tara, who still wants to get her revenge, but Jinx. Jinx is having a lot of fun though, I like that. That cyborg girl right there. <laughs> the freaking air horns. Nice. Great That's job. What? Excuse me. Just saying that out loud. <laughs> forward to those milkshakes i'm really looking forward to drinking those milkshakes while i'm dancing on your graves by the way oh yeah milkshakes by the way favorite milkshake let me know in the comments i'm more of a vanilla fish i know kind of basic i know i know uh, me too. 
How many years? Oh no. But wait, more time machine? <laughs> also, what? Excuse me? This is really weird where we got the young titans and the old titans sitting together and then the old titans are fine with them dying for the plan. We'll wait for these guys to die. Like, okay. <laughs> wait, did it work? It worked. We're a genius. Oh, they're ghost designed. <laughs> Will it work though? Oh. oh. Wait. Wait, what do you mean? You just worked the time machine. Are you telling me time machines do let you touch stuff? But. Yeah, how does that work? They somehow got a time machine, but they can't press a single button. There we go. Find an inconsistency right there. Well, that stinks. <laughs> Any other smart plans, Robino? All right, Rose. This is your chance to break as much stuff as you want. Oh, breaking as much stuff. That's the like. fun stuff. I like, I like that you like that. I know what you like. Oh. I like that, I like that you like knowing what I like. I'd like you to Dang. Stop. Hold on, though. Hold on. Yeah, I don't know. It's just that the more I see Rose and Raven just knowing each other that well, it's like... How well do you both know each other? Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> I joke. All right, let's see some damage, Rose. I need a distraction. Star, act as bait and draw the guard's attention. Oh. As the fisherman beats the fishies. <laughs> All right, beat the best wormy war. Oh. She really meant she's the worm. <laughs> Oh. Dang. Okay, hold on a second. First off, I gotta mention, Starfire can be a great worm when she wants to be. Would you still love Starfire if she wore a worm, though? I'm just curious. Nice. That was quick, but that was nice. So how'd they get- I have a plan to get us out of here! So wait, how did the ghost get captured in there? If they can go through stuff, can they not get through the laser field? Or does the laser field- Can they get the ghost now? Like, is it a ghost-proof room? Another plan? How do you keep coming up with them? <laughs> we wait until our ghosts are reincarnated. Reincarnated? What do you mean, reincarnated? Reincarnation exists? You are exactly right. Once our ghosts are reincarnated, they'll grab a time machine. How many time machines are gonna be involved? It actually worked! Also! I'm surprised that like everybody's so hyped up for this. Everybody's so hyped up for some reason that it involves like three time machines so far. I thought the old man and the ghost would be tired of these plans, but they're really hyped for this. Yeah. They've been reincarnated. What? Excuse me? They they've been reincarnated as small animals. Oh. That's got to be Beast Boy. That's got to. That has to be Cyborg, right? The why did the meerkat steer it? Oh, I was wrong. I thought because the chameleon was green, I thought that was Beast Boy, right? So Beast Boy is the creepy meerkat that's staring at us in the screen? Oh, the chameleon's eyes. One was red, right? Or both were red. Awesome. Hey, rat me. <laughs> <laughs> well, you think for no You got some tight buns. <laughs> oh my goodness! 
Oh, oh yeah, I see Cyborg's red eye. The Cyborg Chameleon does have one red eye. Wait, where'd the Meerkat go? But... <laughs> the, the freaking rat just wants cheese. It's useless. <laughs> New plan. Yo. Stop. <laughs> but you know what that reminds me of? Do you know the... Ah, oh, what was it? The dramatic hamster thing? You know, the, the one that goes do, do, do. And like, you, you get stared at by the hamster. Is that supposed to be what the meerkat is doing, but much more creepier? This is it. Tara, you're up. Get us All right, door. Tara, show us your skills. Tara, yep. These fools don't even see the double cross that's coming. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You. Nobody you said anything. Whoa, I was just asking for you to get us through that door. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Amazing. All right, and once I'm done with this, I'll double cross everybody as I rub my hands together and evilly laugh. <laughs> Nobody will know in the comments that I'm going to double cross everybody soon enough. <laughs> what? I'm not double crossing anybody. Stop it. Yeah, great job. It's reinforced. Yeah. Can we send her back to the trash hole? Oh. Even Rose knows about the trash hole. There you go. You got to get Terra angry. Whoa. Okay, that's actually sick. Dang. Let me guess, was that supposed to be a new move for the Titans? Like an indestructible rock armor kind of thing? Because that was sick. But I love that Rose knows about the trash hole. That's that's great though. Not bad. All I had to do was imagine it was your face. Oh. More confetti. Oh wait. Wait, what? They're all gone? Yeah, that was supposed to be Robin's toilet paper. Yes, they were supposed to be. Oh, wait. What? Fortunately, I was warned of your arrival. Warned? Dang. Oh. You fools. I finally have my revenge. You, 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 you say that, but you're trapped in the bubble too. But wow, so Terra actually double-crossed them the entire time. It's, it's like we were warned about it many times, right? We were, we were, we were, she was shoveling her hands together. It was so obvious and you couldn't see it. I mean, how long does someone have to rub their hands together before you realize that I'm no good? We just thought your hands were cold. I even made you the yarn mittens. Oh. Cute. But my hands are evil, not cold. Dang. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Those are evil hands, though. You think I care? This is a big upgrade over the trash hole. Oh. Crazy if you think we're staying. Wow. Oh. Man. Brian really upgraded that shield. Nothing can get in or get out, but can Raven just, you know, the floor? You know, just make a portal on the floor, unless that's been reinforced too, but. Yeah. Do not waste your energy. <laughs> boom, boom. This cell specifically to counteract your powers. I, I love. Like it. I love how he says powers, but Rose doesn't have any power. She uses weapons. She broke into our own prison cell. <laughs> what? What the? What? Whoa! Hold on, though. Wait. The Bizarro Titans are here. There's Nibor. There's also like this. There's also Beast Boy and the uh, Boy Beast and Cyborgs. I forgot his. Bizarro name, but the one who's mostly human and only a bit of cyborg. But this, but there's robot titans, French titans. There's French titans here. Where the French for titans come from? How many versions of titans are there? <laughs> I gotta say, my favorite out of this whole group has to be the meerkat. I don't know why the meerkat really stands out. Oh Wait, my. Oh, is he being ratatouille? He's being controlled by ratatouille. 
Why are they still excited? Oh, oh boy, what's that? Cavemen? Oh my. <laughs> we need your help getting out of here. Will it actually work this time? Hit that release button. No, no. Goodbye. Oh my goodness. Now they got to deal with a more, you know, non big brain version of themselves, though. I'm really curious. How did the Bizarro Titans? How did that part work? I will love I would have loved to see that version right there. Pretty sure you have to say everything in reverse like the other button. No. Yes. Other button. Boop, 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 boop. But. I want to know how the French Titans worked out the robot. I wanted those scenes. Gaga? 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 Yeah, the milkshake still. Oh, shut it, princess. Hey, I don't like you talking to her like that. Oh. I don't like you talking to me like that for talking to her like that. Oh, you're all so annoying. That is nuts, though. Even if they, even if Rose and Raven might start fighting again, they are still besties, you know. What kind of besties talk to each other like that? Pretty much a lot of besties do. But I do love that Starfire is making evil mittens for her evil hands. I hope you see why I double crossed you. Uh, oh, oh. Why are we fighting? Yeah. Because we hate each other? If that were true, I wouldn't have brought us together. Aww. You us together and save your friends. You think I care if they're locked up a couple of years? They're super annoying. Well, they're not going to be locked up for a couple of years. According to the bad ending with the ghosts and the old men, they've been locked up there for much more than a couple of years, decades even, to the point that they died. So, I'm sure Raven was enjoying the peace and quiet for many, many, many years. They can be the super annoying. Dang. Their power. <laughs> That's their source of power. Calming me out. <laughs> I wanted to hang out with some cool chicks that I like for a change. Oh. Cool? Yeah. Except for that revenge thing. Yeah, that's the only thing though. System. Well, hold so on. This is all peaches and cream, but we're Okay, that's really here. sweet though. Like we can individually, but maybe together. Oh. Together. What is this a lesson? No, we already had that before. If we use our powers together, it may overload the security system. Yeah, we already did the whole power thing. We already did the whole lesson thing and finally a lesson where it turned about about credit score and loans and houses and all that stuff. We don't need another lesson episode. We already got one. We're fine with lessons, I guess. <laughs> How are we supposed to work together? Like this. Oh? Let's do it. Dang, she got her own speaker too? Oh, hold on. Oh. That's what I'm talking about. Nice. I see you managed to escape your cell. But the thing is that they, they, they just made like a big rock thing, though. I was hoping that they would like combine their powers. Like, imagine all their powers combined, making, turning Rose into like the ultimate warrior or something like that. Or the terrorizer combined with all their powers together, like a big glowing rock creature. Now that sounds really cool. But you won't escape your doom. Whoa. Whoa. Hold on, we're actually getting a fight scene? Okay. I will take it. Oh, not. Oh, dang, Rose. She's not giving up. Whoa. Oh. Whoa. Hold on, is that the freaking Buster Blade from Final Fantasy VII? The Buster Sword. That is freaking awesome, though. Making that sword anime-sized, video game-sized. Can it get any bigger? That is sick! Nice! Girls Night 4. <laughs> I'm, glad we, I'm glad we got the confirmation. It is another Girls Night Out. That freaking meerkat, though. I can't stop looking at that meerkat. 
They got the arm through. through? Trouble to get here, so just what? let us open the cell doors for you. Whoa, 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 Hold whoa, whoa. on a second. The doors for you. So you're telling me Cyborg got his arm through the laser, yet he could have just stretched his arm to the freaking release button and let themselves out? You're telling me they could have done that the entire time? Also, were the cavemen? What happened to the cavemen titans? Why are you being so weird? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm sick and thought. Let's just go get those milkshakes. Oh. Milkshake! <laughs> Dang, they just left the boys there. <laughs> Alright, you know what? If they're having fun, cool. Oh my goodness. How many time machines can get involved until it gets crazy? <laughs> what a crazy two-parter, though. I love that the two-parter just turned into another Girls' Night Out episode, and in the end, the girls get their happy ending. They're all best buddies with each other while the guys are just still stuck in jail. Because of chivalry. I love that a little bit of chivalry got the other girls to say, nah, forget it, you know what, forget it. While Raven and Starfire had to do, had, they dealt with a lot more chivalry in part one. But the others, they were just tired after the first bit of it. It was nuts though, the whole time machine gag. We got to see other iterations of Cyborg, Beast Boy, and Robin. To be honest, I was expecting that Meerkat to start staring at us a little more. I don't know why, I just like the Meerkat. I can't believe that Beast Boy is the Meerkat. I thought that the Meerkat was the tallest and... I thought that was Cyborg, but the Chameleon had one red eye. So that's Cyborg right there. I got confused because the Chameleon is green. I thought that was Beast Boy. But... Oh my goodness, what a two-parter though. This was a pretty good two-parter. Took me by surprise, by the way, that... Oh yeah, all of a sudden, here we go. We got a two-parter going on. That... Yeah, the boys got captured. The, the chivalry... Because of their silly chivalry, they got captured. But if the girls got captured too, along with the boys, it would have been another, like, buddies rescue. And we already had that episode where the little buddies helped, you know, break them out. But it was great seeing Jinx. It was great seeing Tara and Rose again. Like, I've been asking, like, where's Rose? Can we get Rose back? But also Tara got to come along and now they're best buddies. Terra's Revenge will come another time, but not tonight, because they got their milkshakes. This was a really cool episode. I really did enjoy, like, Raven and Rose's, like, combination buster sword attack. That was really sick. Knowing I, I know my fair share of games and shows where big swords like that are very common. It's really neat. This whole two-parter has been very neat, and I hope you enjoyed it too. If you did, don't forget to leave a like, comment about what you think, and subscribe if you haven't done so. I will catch you next time.